Kentucky back in 49 and went to Detroit working the assembly line. First year they had me putting the wheels on Cadillacs. Every day I'd watch them beauties roll by and sometimes I'd hang my head and cry cause I always wanted me one that was long and black. One day I devised myself a plan that should be the envy of most any man. I'd sneak it out of there in a lunchbox in my hand. Now getting caught meant getting fired, but I figured I'd have it all by the time I retired. I'd have me a car worth at least a hundred grand. I get it one piece at a time, and it wouldn't cost me a dime. You'll know it's me when I come through your town. I'm gonna ride around in style, I'm gonna drive everybody wild, cause I have the only one there is around. The very next day, when I punched in with my big lunch box and some help from my friends, I left that day with a lunch box full of gears. I've never considered myself a thief, but GM wouldn't miss just one little piece, especially if I strung it out over several years. The first day I got me a fuel pump, and the next day I got me an engine and a trunk, then I got me a transmission and all of the chrome. Little things I could get in my lunchbox, like nuts and bolts and all four shocks, but the big stuff we snuck out in my buddy's mobile home. Now up to now, my plan went all right till we tried to put it all together one night, and that's when we noticed that something was definitely wrong. The transmission was a 53, and the motor turned out to be a 73. When we tried to put in the bolts, all the holes were gone. So we drilled it out so that it would fit, and with a little help from an eight after kit, we had that engine running just like a song. Now the headlights was another sight. We had two on the left and one on the right, but when we pulled out the switch, all three of them come on. The back end looked kind of funny too, but when we put it together and we got through, well, that's when we noticed that we had only one tail fin. About that time my wife walked out and I could see in her eyes that she had her doubts. But she opened the door and said, honey, take me for a spin. So we drove uptown just to get the tags and I headed right on down the main drag. I could hear everybody laughing for blocks around. But up there at the courthouse they didn't laugh cause to type it up it took the whole staff. And when they got through the title weighed 60 pounds. I got it one piece at a time, and it didn't cost me a dime. You'll know it's me when I come through your town. I'm gonna ride around in style, I'm gonna drive everybody wild, cause I'll have the only one there is around. Oh, yo, Red Rider, this is the Cotton Mouth and the Psycho Billy Cadillac, come on. This is the cotton mouth, and negatory on the cost of this here machine, Red Rider. You might say I went right up to the factory and picked it up. It's cheaper that way. Oh, what model is it? Well, it's a 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59 automobile. It's a 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65.